states that have a penchant for destroying alcoholic beverages can no longer enjoy the dividends of river state value added tax. Governor Yeson Wike has said, speaking during a statewide broadcast after the Federal Inland Revenue Service failure to secure a stay of execution to stop rivers from collecting VAT from business businesses in the state, Mr. Wike hinted his victory would affect states with low revenue. River states had the second highest internally generated revenue in 2020, according to a report obtained from the National Bureau of Statistics. Mr. Wiki threw a sub to jab. Yes, at Northern states, whose insistence to be governed by Sharia law has witnessed the loss of millions from the destruction of alcoholic beverages, while these states partake in VAT from alcohol consumption from other states. He said he was aware that the River State government decision to collect VAT would lead to setbacks for some of the of these Sharia compliant states. Naturally, states with ethically restrictive social policies with economic implications may be adversely affected for now, Mr. Wiki said. Over the years, the Isba police enforces of Sharia law has continued to destroy millions of bottles and cans of alcoholic drinks considered a sin in Islam. In an interview with Punch, cano based distributor of alcoholic drinks, Johnson Simon lamented how he lost over 35 million naira to the Hizba police after they destroyed thousands of his alcoholic drinks in November last year. Hmm. Yes, so you cannot eat your cake and have it. They are not crying up and down. Hmm. Wiki, I hear you. You are a through representative of the people. No be lie. Destroying the goods is righteous move but collecting the vat is not foolish northerners this action is long overdue but at least it's a good move in a very good direction my question is if other states forbidding the production of these products in their state where will the vats they are clamoring for comes from very good question you know they chop dog meats but you use teeth Cotton share for children, Mr. Wiki, Christian alcoholic states. Yes, Mr. Hassan, alcoholic proceed beneficiary. I don't take alcohol and I will never do it, but that does not give me the right to hypocritically force my belief on those who take. Even God gave us the right to choose whom we want to serve. So, who is a woman being to judge others as if you have no sin? That is hypocrisy. I think uh, when these people are doing some kind of things, they don't even reason. They think everybody, they just, you know, maybe everybody just like their people, they will just tell you something. You don't even ask questions. Of course, we know that it's affecting everybody, especially in Nigeria, maybe in North African countries. People don't want you to ask questions. When you begin to ask questions, you want to know. They begin to feel offended. But at least to a very large extent, it doesn't really hold water to that extent. And a lot of people are saying, no, we cannot continue with that culture. You know, you are doing something you don't even think through. But when people begin to ask you questions, you begin to you feel offended. It doesn't work that way. You don't want alcoholic drink in your state. You are destroying it. But if it comes the same other state who accepts it, they, people pay taxes on them, but they will still not share it. You say they should share it for you. Uh -uh, it doesn't happen. It doesn't work that way. Just like a lot of people have been saying that if really the way and manner as which the southern politicians they are supposed to do things these people would have been taught a very hard lesson which they will never forget but any any time any little time they will be even you can imagine yes you not ordinary yes you telling southerners that they will not get a presidency if it's, that's how they are, if they are going to put a ban on open grazing you can imagine that you know you, they just behave like children and unfortunately the so-called no uh, social with southern politicians they they fall for all those nonsense and rubbish nonsense and rubbish see the pib B, they just passed see who is favoring they have zamfara in zamfara they have a gold there but it is meant for only them it's meant for only them but not other people now masari masari the governor of casino is doing from that is going to do this it's going to do that but they have been disappointed anyway when you are crying for the fact from the same alcoholic state, you are condemning hypocrites. I hear you, Wiki. If you can implement this in your state, let it stand. One is the man. 
Islamic thieves' infidels, on circumcised Philistines led by a dead president and cost officials, and sowing their soul to the devil, claiming to serve God. They know nothing but just to be shouting like a hungry goat in the name of praying. Ishmael generation like father like son. If I can't drink alcohol and you are benefiting from revenue generated by other states via alcoholic drinks, indirectly is a sin and it is a taboo in Islam. Not indirectly, it is a sin. We're never ready. The best thing is to, to do is uh, to do away with those hypocritical human beings. They preach against alcohol, yet no tribe in the whole country that consume alcohol and hard drugs. More than they do, separation is the only way out and solution. Lopsided legislation has to be looked into now. They ban selling and drinking of alcohol in the north, but they refuse to refuse open grazing ban in the south. Imagine that less cow and headers pay their vats, or they should go to Ruga and collect vats. On this, uh, yes, sir, I am with you who acted me. If the northern can go, if the north can go as far as frustrating fashion dealers on the use of catalogs and detecting for individuals on what type they should cut their heads on their own head, what then stops the southern governors to take to also making life healthy for people of other faith and the northerners at large? Hence, the Nigerian position allows for personal laws suitable for you in your domain, not minding the rights of fellow compatriots. I see many easy ways of letting everyone be on his own in this country without firing a shot, and I am particularly happy that the North has been at the forefront in setting precedence when it comes to hatred, destruction, discrimination, violence, disunity, and lawlessness in Nigeria. Why must they always be allowed to monopolize virtually everything in this country, whereas the, the sustainability of this nation is in the hands of the South? The man of truth, they are drinking alcohol through vats by, uh, uh, from Ketus. They buy from Ketus hypocrites. If Islam will take me to see heaven gates, I'm ready to rot in hell. How can a Muslim control country like the Taliban executes a pregnant woman in front of her family, not minding the child that she is carrying. Hmm. To be honest, if consuming alcohol is haram to Muslims, so also is the process. It is hypocritical to forbid alcohol and yet enjoy its process.